Hey there, it's Janine from Sideline Prep. I hope you're having a fabulous day. I just wanted to talk to you for a couple of minutes because now that the NFL season is kind of winding down as far as auditions go, I've been getting some disheartening emails and some phone calls from some of you that are obviously just really discouraged and frustrated because maybe the auditions didn't go exactly how you had hoped. First and foremost, I'm very sorry. I know that any type of rejection can be extremely, extremely hard. But as I always say, every no is just going to get you closer to your yes. So please do not give up on your dreams. Keep working toward them. Stay positive, stay motivated, and just stay focused. And obviously use your experience um, as a learning tool to kind of figure out what you can do better and what things you need to work on for your next audition process. So one thing that I wanted to kind of pass on to you and offer to you are some morning rituals to kind of get you going, keep you positive, keep you motivated and productive throughout your day. And these are some morning rituals that I try to use whenever I'm feeling a little down. And it doesn't obviously have to be related to pro or semi-pro auditions. It doesn't have to be related to anything um, cheerleading or dance related. This could be maybe you're just down about something that's going on in your professional life or your personal life. And these are just some morning rituals that you can kind of institute on a daily basis to get you pumped <laughs> for the day ahead. First and foremost, as soon as you wake up, practice gratitude and appreciation. So take a moment to think about three to five things that you're grateful for and focus on those things. If you do that first thing in the morning, obviously you're going to already be thinking about and focused on positive things in your life, things that are working well, things that are going right in your life. Number two, leave your phone alone. So there are statistics out there that say most Americans pick up that cell phone first thing in the morning and look at it. And this one can be extremely overwhelming, especially if you open up your email box and see all of the stuff that you have to do from clients or from your boss or anything else. If you open up Facebook, that just might make you even more depressed, <laughs> right? Um, and then especially if you're connected to any type of news outlets, there's always just something very negative, unfortunately, happening in the news. So just leave that phone alone until you absolutely have to tend to it. Next, once you've thought about your gratitude and what you appreciate in your life, then just jot down your top five to-dos for the day. So that way you stay focused and you already know the things that you want to accomplish for that day. And normally these should be things that are related to your long-term or short-term goals, things that you just in general want to accomplish to be um, a better you. Up next, Skip the coffee. <laughs> if you are a coffee drinker, stay away from it. Instead, try lukewarm water with lemon. Now, of course, this is a great source of vitamin C, but in addition to that, it helps jumpstart your metabolism. It also helps to kind of clean out your system, which is great. It gives you energy, and, and also it, it really just flushes out those toxins, like I said, and it keeps your mouth healthy. So, lukewarm water, with lemon. Up next, and I know you already know what I'm going to say, work out. If you can, first thing in the morning, get your workout in. It doesn't have to be in a long extended workout. It can literally be a 15 to 30 minute workout. And obviously this is going to just make you feel so much better. Not only that, but it's going to increase your metabolism, which will be working out, uh, working at a higher rate the entire day. And it's just a wonderful feeling to get your workout in and have that sense of accomplishment first thing in the morning. So again, really quick, your morning rituals from this point forward, practice gratitude and appreciation. Leave that cell phone alone. Write down your top five to-dos for the day that are focused toward accomplishing your goals. Skip that morning coffee and work out. All right, well, I hope this helps. Please, please try to institute these rituals. Um, stay positive. Don't let the audition process or anything else that's not going perfectly in your life get you down. Focus on the positive things and be positive, stay positive, and live a better life and start those morning rituals. <laughs> all right, well, I'm signing off for Sideline Prep and all of our Sideline Prep coaches. I hope you have a wonderful day. Talk to you later.